In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the Wi-Fi password of your Virgin Media router. So I'll be demonstrating this on a laptop, but you can also do this on a mobile as well. And the first step is just to head over to an internet browser. And then from the address bar, you need to type in 192.168.0.1. .1 and hit enter. And that's going to take you over to the login page of your Virgin Media router. So just click on next, and then you'll need to enter your router password in order to access the settings page. Now this password is located on the back of your router, you can see on the screen here. And this is actually different from your Wi-Fi password. So just copy in the digits that are located on the back of your router. This is case sensitive, so make sure you type it exactly as you see it. If you've at some point already changed your password and you've forgotten what you've changed it to, then all you'll simply need to do is reset your router and it will go back to the original default password. You can do that just by holding down the reset button for around about 10 to 15 seconds, and that will go ahead and reset all of your passwords. So once you've entered your password, password, just click on the next button. Once you've entered your password, you'll then have the option to change the password of your router dashboard. Now, once again, this password here is not your Wi-Fi password, so we can just click skip, then click on continue, click next, and select go to dashboard. Now, from the left-hand side, click on Advanced Settings, click on Wireless, and then select Security. Underneath Wireless Security Settings, you'll have the option to change your Wi-Fi password. So just go ahead and create a new password for your Wi-Fi connection. You'll also get a password strength meter at the bottom here. If you have 5 gigahertz enabled on your device, you'll also need to change the password here as well. Once you're finished, scroll all the way down to the bottom and press Apply Changes. And just like that, you've now changed the password for your Wi-Fi router so you can go ahead and connect using your new password. And it's as simple as that, guys. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one.